everyone. Here we are just hanging out in the CTV Morning Live set. Uh, it is the home decor trend that is taking social media by storm. Yes. Have you heard of Huga? <laughs> Lifestyle <laughs> contributor Amanda Forrest joins us with her tips to create the perfect cozy nook. Welcome back, Amanda. Thank you so much for having me. Good to see you. So tell us a little bit about what Huga is. And I mean, we were talking a little bit about how it is uh, in comparison to Feng Shui, for example. That's a really great example. And it's just a Danish version of that, really. And really means living a more cozy lifestyle and a more relaxed, stress-free lifestyle within your everyday life in your home. So there's some really easy elements that you can incorporate to, you know, make your house just feel that much more relaxed when you walk in the door, especially during our rainy days right now. Um, a fireplace is absolutely key. So I really love this unit from Dimplex because it's simply a plug-in unit and actually all of the coloring in the front changes color. Look at this. Watch the rocks change color. So. Here we oh, go. So Look at really that. Cool yeah. in, a, in a dim room. Exactly. And Some this ambience. is super popular because it incorporates storage also into this me media cabinet. So, like I said, across the board, fire and fireplaces are one of the common threads that you need to have in order to have the Huga lifestyle in your home. Okay. okay. Well, so I've got a do? few more elements. Do okay. you want to walk yeah, to the table? Sure. We'll Let's have a look. Okay. What do we have over here? So, I mean, another common thread is textural, like uh, I guess, desaturated colors and textural looks. So, a lot of the, <clears throat> excuse me, a lot of the accessories I brought in, as you'll notice, are not as gorgeous and vibrant as your blouse, but they are gorgeous and textural in their own right. So, let's start off with some of these gorgeous pillows from Urban Barn. This one I love. Everyone wants to touch it. It feels like a beautiful animal. Yeah, this is the furriest. <laughs> it's a full I've ever fur, seen. but it's super cute, oh, and this nice. really embodies the look because it's so soft, so textural. Wouldn't this be gorgeous on on your master? Bed or something sure. like that would be beautiful. And then we go into, again, very gray or very cream, very tan, but always with gorgeous textural elements to it. Um, I thought I'd bring in this cute little tic-tac-toe game because um, if you are staying indoors more and you're enjoying the Huga lifestyle, you're going to want to pull yourself away from the television, sit around the fireplace, oh, and cute. play a board game instead. So I think something like this is great for all ages. And yeah, 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 isn't that fun? We're already winners this morning. Love that. Um, another great example of how to get the Huga lifestyle is by scent. So I love these candles mm, from Indigo. Nice. Aren't they pretty? This one I think is really cool. It's called True North. So let's see if it smells like Canada. So I can like open woods? it. I can't or syrup. I have lotion on my hands. <laughs> let's see what it smells like. Okay, there we go. Does it smell like Canada? Oh, yeah. Oh, it's gorgeous. Very yeah, very, very gorgeous, actually. Um, I love this tray, too. I want to draw your attention to this because, you know, again, we're, I love details. and I'm all about the details. But this beautiful herringbone tray um, from Urban Barn, again, I think is super cute. And this would be great. I'd love to have, like, three of these to keep my jewelry in. But I was setting the candles in there. Um, this is a little bit more, oh, that's cute, isn't it? This oh, is actually a door stop. Yeah, it's really a door stop. But I really love the rope. And again, the textural elements are super strong. And I just thought, you know, this is just something that you don't generally think about needing in your house, but it certainly comes in handy. Oh. And if you need one, you might as well pick one up. That's got this gorgeous design to it. Nice. And this I really liked. Wouldn't three of these along a dining table be gorgeous? Super heavy. It's made of cement. Mm. Oh, um, oh. But to me, this is, again, it's embodying that entire Huga uh, look by using textural elements to create something really interesting, um, but not having a lot of color to it. So along a dining table would be great. So um, specifically, huga means um, texturized elements and not yes. a lot of color. Is that the yes, exactly. element here? Not a lot of color, but most it, it mostly means living a more comfortable life within your own home. Hmm. So it's it's more about layering in a lot of textural elements, being very present. So I say pulling yourself away from the television. Uh, you know, concentrating on family time together. And these elements, like the fireplace, like the cozy pillows and the board games, are all going to add to that huga feeling in the evening when you're at home. Oh, we all need that huga feeling. Yes. <laughs> Amanda, thank you. Very nice design elements this morning. If you want to watch this segment again and learn a little bit more about huga, go to our website, ctvmorninglive.ca. Kim, over to you. Thank you very much. Thank